Hey guys, what's up? So the next poem I'll be reading is poem 1034, and this is called, I Know You Still Want This. This poem is about that ex that left you for someone else, and now they're slowly coming around because they miss you. You love the attention and the praise, so you keep it going, and you finally give him a piece of his own medicine. I know you still want this. I think it's cute how you're acting new. I remember you always used to say when we were together that my game was old, jokingly. But this time, I got a few tricks up my sleeve, and no one will be laughing. I see your Facebook request popping up. I knew it was just a matter of time, liking my selfies one by one, watching my videos one by one, messaging me what's going on day by day, even your new number. All right, I'll bite. I'll see what this goes. I know what you're doing, trying to charm your way back to me. It's how I lost you to him. I'm not going to lie. I love the attention. And now you miss all of this. You want all of this. You need all of this. Telling me how good I look. You too, baby boy. So damn fine. Why don't you do me a favor and send me a sexy selfie? I'm in need of TLC. Telling you how much I still love you. That you should have never let me go for that fucking loser. Telling you that you still have a place in my heart and always will. You keep telling me things are so bad, that he treats you so bad, that you need a good guy, that I am that guy. You can't believe that you did this switch. Not talking to me, you realize that I was the biggest mistake you made in your life. You're at work reflecting. I'm making you think. You are looking at our old photos, reflecting those times. It's funny how the world works in the most mysterious ways. And now, you miss all of this. You want all of this. You need all of this. I told you to meet me at 6 at my place. You knock at the door. As I finish texting someone, I open it up and see you. And you practically tackle me, massaging your tongue with mine. Removing your shirt. Taking my jeans off, grabbing your ass, biting my ear, and all of a sudden, you're hearing your name, but not from me, from his voice, right by the door. Well, I guess it's finally over, and now that I think about it, it's getting late, too, so you should leave and never come back.